In this video, I will show you my five favorite climbing and training books. I know you can't learn everything from books, but I think you can always learn a little bit from here and there and watching videos and reading books. So yeah, just take every op opportunity you get and learn some new things and enjoy this video. This is a really nice book. It's called Mastermind by Jerry Moffat. To have the right mindset is probably one of the most important things to reach your true potential in climbing. And this book is probably the best book on this topic and on, and on the mental side of climbing. And it has some really great insight from the author Jerry Moffat, of course, which, is a, which was one of the best climbers in the world. But yeah, there are also some insights from Adam Ondra, for example, or Alex Megos um, or, or Alex Honnold or um, people like that. So a really great book about improving your mental skills. And yeah, it's just really nice. I think especially the parts about vis visualization and goal setting are like my favorite parts of the book. This book is the oldest one of the books I will show you in this video. And this is already the third edition. It's very scientific. It's maybe not that easy to read. So I wouldn't necessarily recommend it to beginner climbers or like, yeah, when you just start out, out with training, it can be a little bit overwhelming, I think. But if you're a little bit more into it, then this is really nice. It has so, many great insights about technique, the mental side as well, um, nutrition, um, just everything. How to make a training plan and stuff like that. Everything you need to um, train hard and get better at climbing. This book here, right here, the Climbing Bible, is pretty similar to the um, training for climbing book but it's a little bit easier to read and not as scientific I would say and not as many stuff in it but it still has everything from technical stuff to yeah, f the physical and mental um, tr um, kind of training f for climbing so it still has a lot to offer but I think it's a little bit yeah easier to read and maybe more more suited for like beginner climbers. I won't say it's not for more experienced climbers because you can still learn a lot in this book. But yeah, it's a little bit easier, nicer to read. Another thing I really, really like about this book, especially as a photographer, is those nice photos in there. Yeah, they make me want to go to Norway and especially also Rocklands in Africa. There are also some really nice pictures from there in there. And yeah, that's also one of my favorite things about this book is just the, the photos. So, yeah, <laughs> can really recommend it. It's, it's just so nice. So the next book is a little bit more, it's called Peacemaking. It's from Ned Fieli. I hope I pronounced it right. This book is more focused on finger strength training. But it has also some stuff about like core and mobility stuff, which is really nice and um, some nice exercises in there. And I think it also helped me a lot to understand like the how the the hand and fingers are like how do you could build so the tendons and stuff like that. It's really nice explained in there, and it's the best book probably about finger training. There's a lot of stuff in there about this topic, and. Yeah, <laughs> I can really recommend it. The last book is actually not one book, but a type of books. And these are called climbing guidebooks. I know this sounds crazy. Why, why should guidebooks help me climb better? But these books don't teach you technique or stuff like that. But it's just, I think, you can learn a lot in books and also videos like mine um, but if you don't practice it, practice it and do it on the wall then this is all for nothing and the knowledge doesn't 
help you with anything if you don't use it. So just go out there, go climbing, do your training. Yeah, that's the most important thing. If you don't do it, you can't, can't get better. So yeah. <laughs> so right now, after this video, you get out or like do some mobility work or I don't know, just do some training to get better. If you have any good books on climbing and training or which helped you climb better, then please leave them in the comments down below. I really would like to know some more books. And if you like this video, then it would mean a lot if you could share it with a friend who might also benefit from this video. And also, if you like this video, of course, subscribe and like the video. That would also help me a lot. And yeah just enjoy your day and i see you guys in the next video <laughs> oh fuck <laughs> can you see it Whoa.